Hey guys, my name is Simsy. How are you all doing? Welcome back to some more Crusader Kings 2 on the Game of Thrones mod. We are playing as House Stark. So guys, if you still are enjoying this series and would like to see more, the best thing you guys can do is leave a like and a comment and subscribe if you're new around here. All the download links are in the description as well if you want to download the mod and play along with me. Oh no guys, Winterfell has fallen and I think some of my sons have died as well. You have a new heir. If your character dies now, you will play as Brandon, Lord of the North. Lord John is no longer cheap. What? Okay, so the Great John's a White Walker now. Roderick's a White Walker. Your wife, Jane Westerling, has died. And now it falls to you to decide whether or not to be... Oh, so Jane West... My wife deserves to be... Nah, fuck my wife, honestly. Um, She's dead now. The defenders of Winterfell tried their hardest to resist the onslaught of White Walkers, but it was not enough. The terrible frozen horde overwhelmed the garrison, swarming through Winterfell and killing all its inhabitants. So who's died? Oh god. Oh god. Right. So my my son Eddard's died. My bastard legitimized daughter Lyanna's died. Benjamin's died. Jon Snow's still about. Sansa has turned into a, a White Walker. And so has Arya Stark. Bran is down in the, uh, the neck. And Rickon is still here as well. Oh, fuck. Okay, then, guys. After the, uh, well, fall of Winterfell, the second Red Wedding, I guess you could call it the White Wedding. I guess all weddings are, are white, if you know what I mean. But, uh, especially wedding nights. <laughs> a wedding and a bedding. Oh, God. Anyway, right. Um, after that, my children and wife have been slain. We need a new wife. And what we're going to have to sort of do is we're sort of going to have to sort of pivot around with this uh, Tully, I think... No. Oh, what wick? Oh, okay. I thought they were Tully. Huh. Oh. The Ironborn are up here actually helping me. I didn't even realise that. We're going to have to pivot around and help with them. The Tullys are coming. Slowly but surely. Uh, that should be enough to definitely help me. Now, looking through the marriages, I'm going to sort by age just for the time being. There's not really that many ladies. There was a Tyrell, but I saw a Lannister in here. I went through most of the major kingdoms, and I can actually probably get a marriage with a Lannister, which would be great if we survive in the future, we can push their claim and take the Westerlands. So, Kevin is currently Lord Paramount of the Westerlands. He has two living children, Sir Martin, who is married, and he has a daughter, Jane. So, we're going to betroth him to Rob. Rob's 22. She's 8. That's not too much of an age gap, but it doesn't really make much difference back in these days. I want to try and get a couple more bastards, but that sucks. Uh, Bran is still married to Blackwood, 12 and 14. They haven't come of age just yet. Rickon is 10, and Glover is 7. And it is 6 years. After in total, after the technical, technically like the start of the game, the start of the War of the Five Kings. So what we're gonna have to do is slow things down. We're pretty much just going to have to, like I said, just sort of pivot around and s hopefully survive. Okay, to the kindly noble Rob, your wisdom and mercy are legendary. <laughs> I have decided to accept your suggestion to betroth you. Okay, excellent. Right, so in the future, if we survive, like I said, we're at 80% close to capitulation. We might be able to do so. Okay, time has passed, yet to the... Okay, yet the, realm, the world seems unreal. It is if life without Barber... Oh, it's his lover. Oh, it's okay. Oh, and like, fuck me, is a mama's farce. I'm lost in a sea of loneliness loneliness, and know not where to turn. Oh, fuck, poor Rob. I'd fucking be livid as well. You've lost your lover. You, you've lost your wife. Your mother and your two daughters have turned into White Walkers. You lost your three children. And all, you, all you've got left is Bran and Rickon. And, and for some reason, bloody... John won't come and help at all. Time has passed. So, drown your sorrows in wine and song. Okay. Lose yourself in book, song, and wisdom. 
seek solace in the arms of another. <laughs> Sabella. Okay, so this was 16. Good. A bit chubby, but all right. Big boobies. <laughs> right, I reckon, Rob, yeah, let's do that then. Or we could go celibate. Right, let's go with you then. Let's get some bastards up in here then. Uh, your grace... Oh, yes, I asked for a mace at the Citadel because I had to redo all this because a lot of people died. Um, so let's get a new... Ma oh, perfect. We've already got a new mace Because Hand of the King is now Galbert Glover. Roos is the Master of Law. Rickard Karstark is Master of Arms. Rob is leading. What is how? Who is Howland's twenty? Galbert's there as well. Okay, they need to rally up. Okay, let's continue slowly but surely. Sixteen with you. All right, we need to try and keep with this Greyjoy host. How far away are the Tullys? They're still coming. Eighty-seven percent to capitulation. Fuck, they're coming for me here, guys. Hopefully I can have another bastard daughter, though. Come on. We just need to pivot around and just go back and forth with this army because we we don't have enough men. Like, well, we don't have enough money as well. So we'll just hold here. 8,000 is holding with me. They could come for me, though. We're going to get surrounded here, aren't we? And then I could lose Rob. We are... The Tullys are coming. We could flee to Skagos. Uh, but then we're fucking surrounded if we go there, aren't we? Fuck, I've sort of got myself in a pickle here. Uh, what's happened here? Uh, maybe we could try and take their capital, make them capitulate, maybe take a couple of their castles, now that we've got that 8,000, because there's not really anywhere we can run. They're chasing us now. Yeah, try and push them off. I don't know how the attrition's going to do. We just need to draw these guys away, and hopefully let the Tullys come up and help us. Because this is going to be close, this fight. I don't know how you're meant to stop the White Walkers, because this is just bonkers. Like, honestly... Like trying to stop this, I could get, I could understand. Uh, we've just been, we've just been stopped here, All right? How well are we doing? Five thousand victory. We have victory. Let's continue to push north. I think. Where, did, where, where's the Ironborn army? Come on, the Tullys are coming here. Oh my god. At 81%, out of curiosity, if I wanted to, could I surrender? No, they wouldn't let me. By bloody hell, this series is going to be the death of me, I reckon. Alright, I guess we just hold here. Because I don't know where everyone else is. We won that. Yeah, I, I want to, I think like, mate, like we just knocked out 8,000. I'm sort of like a bit cocky. I think we should sort of push. We can't get any more of our men, can we? No, we haven't got enough money to get any more. Ask for help with your titles. Uh, what else can we go through here? Not, nothing really much. Okay, so we're being hit by the 16k. What has happened? Oh, God. Okay. You stood in the thick of battle. Dire wolf at your side, defending you from harm. Eventually, the enemy overcame us and your beast was slain. <gasps> oh, my God. No. No, 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 no. Eventually, yeah, eventually the enemy came over us a bit. It did, it did savage us. It did savage enough men to allow you to escape, and your men later recovered its body. Depressed, oh god, Rob's about to just fucking kill himself, I reckon. What was his dire wolf, wolf's name? Was it, was it Grey Wind? I think it was. Foolish child. Oh, hang on. Hang on a minute. Fighting across the field, you see an enemy soldier cut off from the others. Others, get it? Get it? <laughs> As you get closer, you realize it's enemy soldier, the White Walk. Wait, the White Walker, the White Walker. Prepare to die, scum. Is this the faction leader? Yes, in the midst of battle, you and the White Walker, White Walker circle each other 
tense and focus. The raging scene around you seems to slow down as you scan for any signs of weakness, weakness any opening in his defense that you could possibly exploit. Oh god. One, one mistake is all he gets. You attack with speed. He is no match for my might. Attack with force. He's not even managed to touch me. So I guess it's like rock, paper, scissors, essentially. So it looks like we can kill the faction leader of the White Walkers. We can attack with speed. We can attack with force. We can attack with a defensive stance. Now I'm assuming, does Rob have... He's a brilliant commander, trained fighter, rebel leader... I'm just sort of trying to see what he's sort of got here. Does like does this sort of help? Yeah, this attack with speed. You see a weak spot and a vulnerability in the White Walker's defense. It's not much, but it's all you need. Strike! You easily break through the White Walker's guard and knock him to the ground. He lies sprawl sprawled at your feet, completely at your mercy. It's all over now, baby. You strike, but the White Walker rolls to its side, wounded, but is very much alive. He rises to his feet and reaches for his... Why won't you... Reaches for his weapon. Why won't you die? Is this going to go again, is it? Oh, my God. Let's go with the defensive stance. You see a weak point, vulnerable. Wait, what? Okay, the White Walker drops his weapon and throws up his hands. Yield, I yield. No, you infidel. <laughs> what is... Okay, okay, I accept back on your feet. The White Walker is defeated. No, you infidel. White Walker is slain. Yeah, fucking slay this White Walker. This fucking White Walker murdered my sons and my children. My children and my... My, my siblings. White Walker crumbles to the groundless. You wipe his blood from your weapon. It's okay, right. Valamogules. The fight is over. The White Walker lies dead. You have won. The White Walker falls. Excellent. And if we just won that off the bat then. Oh my god. Like this. <laughs> Maybe. Honestly, I'm going to have to save after that because if a game crashes, I'm going to just lose my shit. I think we might be able to win this. Let's push north now. I think we can do it. Let's push north. We slay, we we slew the White Walker there. Excellent. Rob Stark, with ice in his hand, one on one, slew a White Walker. We've dropped it down to sixty to ninety. We got them on the back foot. We've destroyed their two major armies. Let's go and and take them out. Let's push upon their capital with Ironborn <laughs> with us, Wildling and. And Bannerman of House Stark, and we've been hit here again. Oh my god, prepare to die, White Walker. Is this going to happen again? Right, I've already read through this, so I guess we'll attack with speed. You parry the White Walker, but pummel delaying your sword to strike, to strike. You die. Valamogules. Victory is mine. Oh my god, Rob Stark is just like, he's just so enraged. Where do they keep on coming from? Sir Roderick. There's so bloody many of them now. He's got the taste for White Walker now. White Walker... Wait, what? The White Walker has your mother, Catelyn, executed. Yeah, well, isn't she already gone? I don't think you can turn anyone back. Oh, God. Crusader Kings 2 has stopped working. Oh, for fuck's sake. Sorry about that one, guys. As you would have seen, I had a game crash. I'm pretty sure it popped up on screen. I could see it. You surely would have been able to with my recording. Regardless, we've knocked off two White Walkers. We're waiting for the Tullys to push up now. There's nearly a, a bloody lot. Uh, fuck. That was really quick. What's just... Oh, my God. Okay. So, we've lost as the Tullys have arrived. Oh, God. This, this is going to be close. Like, honestly. At least the Tullys are coming here to help us now. We might be able to knock the White Walkers back. Oh, God. I don't feel too well. Please kill me! Okay, the Tullys are coming back. Oh god, there's two separate armies going. We, they need to get that 10k one here. Oh no, they've lost that one there. Oh god, I think the Tullys just lost. They won at one point. Oh god, what's happened? Your Grace. Your grace, his grace, Stannis... Oh, okay, King Stannis is taking his life, mate, babes. 
Oh no, Stannis Baratheon has died. Died of a period of illness. Queen Shireen Baratheon is upon the Iron Throne. She is married to Edric Storm. I wonder... I wonder if she's more inclined to marry Bethany to me, because that that'd be better than me having um Westerling. But then I don't know, that's the risk. Hang on, what I uh Um fuck. Brand's nearly of age though. So Stannis is dead. Just what we need. Alright, rally up. Alright, I has been executed. I'm alive. I've survived after a period of illness now at 38%. We're smashing the White Walkers now. There's a fight going on here. God, get here. We just inherited a fuck ton of titles, though, which I need to give away. Alright, let's continue to push here. We need to deal with the White Walkers first. It's going to fuck up my vassals, though, isn't it? Okay, I'm probably just going to have... Actually, I'll try throw in... I'll try to get everyone in here. Okay, um, so Edmure's died. Do we have the... Oh, okay, right. Right, okay, um... <laughs> I lost the Riverlands because Edmure was back, so now Edmure's dead, and now I have the Riverlands back. Does that mean I control these armies now? Yeah, I do. Moneylenders are here seeking the repayment of Lord Paramount Edmure's debts. They will get their 250 gold. The debt will be due in five years. Now, is my debt... Because we've got a we've got a loan we need to repay. Yeah, that was... Okay, we can pay it. Because I'm pretty sure we had a standing debt. Ask the Iron Bank for a loan, that's fine. Okay, so now we've actually got the, the armies of the Riverlands because Edmure's died. Yeah, get everyone up here. While we control these armies, that'll be fine. Right, we need to... We can probably take Winterfell back. We probably can divvy up some of these armies and push north. Shireen Baratheon now has been uh, made officially the queen, but she's no queen of mine. Excellent. Right, let's continue. We need to get rid of these armies, and then we need to push north. Man, we've got crazy attrition going on. I think we could, we could push and retake Winterfell, but I think we're better off pushing north ourselves and taking their capital. Finishing off this army, then pushing north. We should be able to win this. Come on. God, this... Okay, yeah, now push north, push north. 5,000 Starks at the back. Can we get any more men? We can get some more levies. Oh, I didn't even realise. It looks like the Greyjoys actually are besieging Winterfell for me. Right, let's get the make these guys go north then. We'll deal with this size later. 16% our way. We might be able... We might have survived winter. We might have survived the fight for the dawn. By bloody hell, guys. If we come back from this, this must be just an insane play. Sheer dumb luck, as McGonagall would say. We're at 16%. Alright, let's push north. Oh god. It's cold, far colder than here my entire life, but suddenly the wind stops, I realise. Oh god. <laughs> We got, like, ambushed. Alright, come on, let's keep pushing north. We need to take their capital. Which I'm assuming is this. I'm assuming this, the Shivering Forest is their capital. We just need to make them capitulate. We've nearly taken Winterfell back. We've got 2,000 troops there, currently. We're pushing here now. The Siege of Winterfell was successful. Want to do a save. It's cold. I know, we're getting crazy attrition up here. Alright, they're at 40%. Let's push and take it. We've taken the Shivering Grove. 
Is that it? Is that all we needed to do? Let's take some others then. Let's take the Northern Frost Fangs. Once they get to a hundred, we should be right. Three days. They're gone. Um, I'm not entirely sure what we should go, but uh, probably Then here, yeah. Hit the Thens at the back. Right, what the fuck's going on here? We've nearly taken Winterfell by the looks of it. We've got reinforcements going from the Riverlands. God. <laughs> uh, I don't believe it, honestly. We might be able to pull this. I thought, like, it was GG three episodes in. But I think we're going to be able to pull back. But after losing all those children as well. Horrific, to say the least. Right. 75%. Alright, what's this? Right, for some reason it's letting me now give out some of these lordships. It bloody wasn't before. So we can give the High Lordship of Riverrun to Brandon Stark. That's probably not a bad idea. Um, we need we only can hold four. So we lord, High Lordship of the Trident, Winterfell Riverrun. Um, so I think maybe we'll give the lower four. Actually, is Rickon alive? Maybe I couldn't... Yeah, I can grant these to you. I'll grant, I'll go, I'll grant the lower one, oh shit, I'll grant the lower ones to Rickon. Because we, when then we can give two to Bran. I can't give any to John, can I? No. Let's give, um, I guess we give River Run to Bran. And High Lordship of the, Lord, we got the Lordship of River Run, High Lordship of the Trident. I guess I give you High Lordship of the Top. Oh, that's not even... That's not even five gone. Hopefully I haven't made him, like, too powerful. Okay, so now this is just a mess down here. And do I not control these guys? I still control a majority. You just need to spread it out, though. At the moment, we're going to bloody inherit... Um... We're going to inherit brand stuff anyway, because we, we don't have any children. Right, your Bannerman Lord is under... Yep, I'll deal with you once I'm sort of dealing with the White Walkers. Who's he been attacked by? Tyrosh Slavers. Brilliant. Just what we need. What? The speed of the carriage picks up more. That rat. Okay. Oh, shit. Rob's died. Brandon is no longer the chief. Oh, God. After all that, he's died. Oh, for fuck's sake. King Rob has taken his last, last breath at age 24. He died under suspicious circumstances. Guilty of sin and pride, he warned. He wanted everyone to know his greatness. A wicked man, Rob will surely pay for his sins. Oh, fuck. In the afterlife. After all that. I don't believe it. So, Rickon's the new heir after that. Uh, my brother, yes, all shall attend. Bran, all hail, King Brandon, the King of the North, who is now commanding the armies. Oh my god. Oh, that sucks. I really, really wanted Rob to uh, continue on. Oh well, we need to retake some of these lands. Seven out of five. There's a way to increase your domain size, but I don't know how to do it. Okay, we've just taken another territory now. The funeral. Packs upon packs. Peasants and nobles alike gather in the courtyard and the surrounding streets to catch a glimpse of the deceased. As the procession leads the body of King Rob through the crowded streets to the crypt. The, po uh, the mourns and sorrows. Damn. The leading train stops to say blah, blah, blah. Go through the dark holes in blind individual farewells. And so be it. Rob Stark, the king in the north. The first king in the north after so many thousand years. Is dead. The White Walkers are at 84% to capitulation now. We've nearly taken Winterfell back. I'll deal with the, the size and just a lot of other stuff that I'm sort of ignoring. I just want to try and get rid of these White Walkers. 
83%. We, they can't surrender. Alrighty, we're pushing upon Ant Vale now. They're at 86% to capitulation. They still won't... Uh, they still won't bloody um, surrender. Oh, we can probably push Winterfell now. Hang on a minute. Yep, victory. We've taken Winterfell back. Perfect. I'll deal with all this stuff later. Right, uh, what was that? I uh, would like some help with that. Uh, call the realm for aid. Okay, so... What? Victarion joined? You're joking. After all that? What the fuck? Ugh. Alright. After I <laughs> asked him to repay me for... Uh, fuck, I asked him to pay me for raiding compensation, and he still gave it to him. Oh, good on him. Right, we still can't take this yet, though. Two more days before we can take another one of their, whatever, castles, whatever you want to call it. Okay, so we actually pushed on something else then. Come on, it's at 95, god damn it. The attrition is just bonkers. Oh, we can get most of these guys back anyway, by the look of it. Right, push here then. Right, how far away? We've nearly got them on the ropes. We even got troops down here. What is going on here? High Lordship of the Crags going on. The Riverlands looks like a fucking gory mess. Alright, come on. Okay, this has been a proper war. <laughs> like, honestly, they're at 100%. Uh, and force demands. So, what happens? They lose 1,000 prestige, gains all this good stuff. Oh my god! What are you lying back on my chair? The other's invasion of the north has ended. King Brandon has won. Uh, we've thrown them back. Now, this isn't quite what the world should look like. If I'm being honest. Why isn't the Night's Watch back? They should be. Anyway, uh, what I'll do is I'll pretty much disband everyone, I think. We even had 200 hired men. Okay, because I think it's a time of peace in Westeros for the time being. I've got to fix up some of this mess here. So, we've won. <laughs> but... At what cost? What a huge cost, if I'm being honest. Sansa's still alive, but she's a white walker. There's no way we can... Yeah, I can't invite her to my court. So, Rob died, along with his three children. King Brandon, the cripple, is upon the northern throne. Bethany Blackwood is his wife. Okay, what's going on here in the Vale now? Robert Arryn has come of age and is married to a Frey. Okay, Victorian Greyjoy is the king of the Iron Islands. I uh, don't think he's king, actually. No, yes, he is king. Who's of the Rock? King Martin of the Rock. Princess Cersei. So, Kevin's died. So, what's going on here in the Iron Throne? So, Queen Shireen... What in the fuck's this? Okay. What, how does Edric Storm have brothers? Oh, his mother. His bastard. His mother. Okay. I, I just didn't realise how that made sense. Um, King Willis Tyrell of the Reach. So it looks like everyone's got their independence going on here. And what's going on down in Dawn? Prince Doran. And then there's this whole sort of... There's a couple of like... What is this? The crag shit going on? But guys, I think we've pulled it back, but what a massacre. The White Walkers came down and killed Rob and all his sons. I've still got sisters who are White Walkers, but now I think we can consolidate our forces. We probably don't need to worry about the White Walkers again. Probably do. Probably going to have to go to war with them again, more than likely. I thought they, they're all their lands would have gone. But regardless, guys, thank you very much for watching. Hope you guys still are enjoying this Crusader Kings 2 series, playing as House Stark. If you still are, please leave a like and a comment. It's the best way for me to gauge your support. 
if you guys want to see uh, more Crusader Kings 2, more scenarios, there's a lot of, obviously there's seven kingdoms we can play on, so yeah, check out my social media links if you haven't already, want to stay connected with me, Facebook, Twitter and Instagram, all in the description below, if you guys want to get yourself some cheap and reliable games, maybe even some PSN and Xbox codes, um, maybe, I don't know, uh, strategy games, <laughs> check out my G2A affiliation link in the description below. Patreon and Steam group, come and join the community on Steam. Stay tuned for more videos on the channel. My name is Ben Simsy. Take care. Goodbye. Some really close cinematic shots here, pushing through the bridge. Oh, look at. <laughs> that was probably the shot of the video there.